Welcome back to Computers and Everybody. Today we are going to learn linear search and what is it about and we are also going to implement that. So let us see what is it. Linear search in C to find whether a number is present in an array or not. Now if it is present then at what location it is present. Also this linear search is known as sequential search. We compare each element with the element to search until we find it the list ends. Suppose here you see we have to find 98. 98. Now in the first position of the array we have 10. So 98 is not there. Then we go to the second. 45, 8, 2. Then we get 98. And then our linear search algorithm is complete and we find that. So we go one by one by searching it. Now here we are writing hash include stdio dot h hash include conio dot h. Now int main and here we are taking the inputs. We are taking an array an element search i for the looping part and n to enter the number of elements so this was the input declarations now print f enter the number of elements in the array n we will write like how many elements do we want in the array 3 4 etc so we are scanning it scan f percent d and percent n so it represents the number of elements next we come to printf enter the integer elements enter the integers of the array now we will enter we will take input in the array here we are writing the whole array and then we will search so entering the array elements next comes scanf we have to scan this element we have to take input for this so we will give ampersand array of i because this is an array we have taken as input and then we are taking this into the scanf part this is the i which we declare over here the next part comes for the traversal part for i equals to 0 i is less than n n means the number of elements present in the array if it is 4 then i will be less than 4 i plus plus incrementation then in the next line this for part we are taking as the array inputs 
so we are writing it over here so next line scan f person d search So we forgot to give a semicolon over there. Yeah, now it's okay. Print F. Enter the elements to search. Now, if you want to search a number, we have to then enter the elements, and then it will go and search it in the array if it is present or not. Then for the next line, scan F, percentage D, and percent search. Next, we come to the conditions for i equals to zero, i is less than n. Again, we are writing the same thing while taking the array input. What we have written, we are writing the same thing over here. Now we will give the conditions to check whether the element is present or not. Print f. Actually, we should not write print f over here. No, we have to first give the conditions, then we will write print f. So we remove it. If a array is array of i is equals to equals to search, then then we will give print f. Then we have to print array of i is equals to e equals to search. Then print f. Percentage d is present in the array. This means we have founded the element in the linear search array. Okay, so we will write the array, the, the number is present in the array. We are writing i plus 1 means we would print also print the position of the array. Like if a number 4 is present in the array, in which position of the array the number 4 is present, we are also printing that. Now in the next line, we are applying a break statement. Suppose 4 is found in the array and uh, then the program automatically stops because we don't need to go further and check again for some again condition some another condition we are not going to check for that because we have found the element that's why we are putting a break uh, statement over there now if we don't found then if i is equal to equals to n then printf the element is not present in the array Now at the end we are writing return 0 
and then we are completing the full program of the linear search now let me show you the full program as a whole so this was the total program that hash include hdio.h we all know that it is a preprocessor so this is the preprocessor include conio.h is the console input output like we use some functions like clsr get ch all these are controlled by this header include conio.h so this is the control input output this is the full program and i think now we should compile it now let's see the output now we have entered the number of elements in 5 we are entering the number of integers enter a number to search let us search a number now see it is located in the location is 2 now then the linear search is done now let us take some another example if we take like enter the elements in the array then we are entering then we are entering three numbers then six is not present in the array so it is not present in the linear search 